Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now am found. Was blind, but now I see. Hello, friends, my viewers, my subscribers. It's amazing. Honeybees are amazing creatures created by God, friends. Today, I'm gonna talk amazing groups had 10 days beekeeping training last week at Rural Resource and Training Center, CAU, College of Agriculture, University, Pasighat, Arunachal Pradesh, friends, Central Agricultural University, Impal. They had amazing scientific beekeeping training, friends. Let's hear what is their comments and what's their feedback on 10 days scientific beekeeping training friends What is your experience during this last 10 days training program on scientific beekeeping? What you like to that leave the message for the people? And what is your experience? Please share to the people. Uh, hello viewers of Bee Brother channel. First of all, I would like to introduce myself. Myself, Deke uh, Langbang, student of Horti uh, College of Horticulture and Forestry, Pasigat. Uh, which uh, university is Central, uh, Central Agriculture University Imphal and here I am in the beautiful campus of RRTC uh, which uh, here in RRTC they offer a wide variety of course uh, which one of them is beekeeping beekeeping before we learn theoretically more theoretically which uh, we are not um, explored how scientific beekeeping is done but when I did my training here in RRTC for 10 days, I came to learn that scientific beekeeping is one of the most profitable uh, profession I can say. And here, through the guidance of Sir Joseph uh, Basumatri, uh, I have learned a lot about beekeeping, right from the, uh, colony division to harvesting of honey to value added product honey and uh, this one and how honeybees are important to us human being uh, honeybee first uh, they help in poll pollination which pollinate 80% of the agriculture crops what is your experience during this last uh, 10 days training program on modern scientific beekeeping brother please sir okay uh, hello everyone first of all I'll, inter I'll introduce myself my name is Bapendap Lang Dokling then uh, I'm student of horticulture from College of Horticulture and Forestry, mm -hmm. Arunachal Pradesh, Central Agriculture University. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, first of all, I would like to thank Sir Joseph. He's yeah. very experienced, uh, very expert in beekeeping, and I've got to learn a lot about beekeeping. Uh, I'm very interested and motivated right now to do and start the beekeeping. So uh, as per uh, after the training, I've learned uh, so many uh, about the uh, beekeeping, and here. Uh, Practically, I've learned uh, how to maintain the bee uh, scientifically so that we'll get uh, more more yield of honey. And uh, I came to real realize that uh, beekeeping, I, I can earn a lot. And uh, just here in RT RRTC itself, around uh, 10 kg average of honey they are uh, producing per hive per year. So it's really inspiring and uh, I'm, I'm going to do this at home. Yeah. Uh, what do you think that... After graduation, after your masters also, 
if you are not getting any job so do you think that this uh, beekeeping activity will be a life career and we can generate good revenue out of beekeeping do you think uh, def definitely sir uh, uh, after i graduate if i don't get job surely i'll start beekeeping and right now itself i'm starting i already yeah. start uh, uh, maintaining the beehive and and one more thing i want to say that even uh, for the people here so many are jobless uh, you come to learn from here from sir joseph you come visit RT, R rtc and get the training uh, surely i'll see you in in this especially in our state in meghalaya if you come here we get uh, plenty of scope to do the beekeeping and you can earn uh, your livelihood and uh, you can earn a lot from this so i i would like to encourage you to come here and learn and myself i'm sure that i will do it <laughs> yeah Yes, uh, one more sister is here, a student from Fasi Ghat, Arunachal, this uh, College of Agriculture University. So I would like to ask from the sisters, what is her experience during this last 10 days training program on modern scientific beekeeping? Sister, what do you want to say about this? Uh, firstly, I am very thankful to uh, Sir Joseph and RITC for providing this platform. In to be honest, uh, I didn't know that beekeeping was so interesting and um, I got to learn many things from an expert mm -hmm. so I'm very thankful for that and uh, I think it is it can be performed as a hobby as well as a profession so like In case you are not getting any government job do you think that this beekeeping farming also can be one of the livelihood for the farmers? Uh, what do you want to say? In case you are not getting the job are you uh, going to do continuous with beekeeping practice and generate income out of beekeeping? Yes, sir, definitely. Uh, this time when I go back home, I want to try beekeeping. Uh, I've been very inspired by your works, and uh, I'm going to teach my family members also and my relatives mm -hmm. so that together we can uh, yeah. produce big uh, production of honey and bees. And I want to also uh, take these ideas to my back to my state, and I want yes. to help them. Okay, thank you so much sister for sharing your experience. Thank you. All the best. Uh, there is one more student. He is last, not the least. I hope he will, he will speak a lot, a lot in the sense that he will share with the people, with my viewers. So, brother, so as you are the student of horticulture from Pashigar, Arunachal Pradesh, and you are also here, one of them, the 10 days, during last 10 days you attend this scientific beekeeping training. We had a lots of practical demonstration also in the field. So what is what you observe and what you notice in uh, this beekeeping? So what do you want to say? What do you want to express on regard this beekeeping activities, brother? Please share. Okay. Uh, thank you for giving me <coughs> the time to express to express my experience. Yes. <coughs> my name is Takumboa uh, Imsong. And I'm also from uh, College of Horticulture and Forestry. Mm -hmm. And after coming here, uh, I've learned a lot. Actually, from before, I was also interested in beekeeping. Actually, I wanted to start from from last year, but yes. because uh, due to some circumstances, I couldn't start. But after coming here, I was also inspired a lot through all the experiences mm -hmm. <coughs> from our expert, Sir Joseph. <laughs> so what do you see in RRTC that beekeeping activities is, uh, is uh, flourishing, it is uh, growing, uh, it has been doing well. What do you want to say that beekeeping practices in RRTC? What do you see, brother? How many colonies are you see, you have seen the RRTC, that RRTC bee colonies? I've seen around, uh, around 100 plus. Yes. There are 100 plus uh, beehives. Yes. And the production is also good. Yes, and, and the management and everything is done scientifically. Yes, and about the extraction, the management, mm -hmm. and all. Okay, brother. So, as this training center is basically for the farmers level, and beside the farmers also even professors, even the college students and school students, they are coming here in order to learn beekeeping then brother so just you leave the message who are not coming here rrtc so 
what do you want to say to them? You want to invite them to learn in beekeeping here at RTC? Or what do you want to say about that? Because as you said that uh, 100 above bee colonies are existing in rural resource and training center. And also you had experienced 10 days here. You have seen everything, what beekeeping activities, how it is going on here. So what do you want to leave the message for the people who are not coming here? Either they need to come here or not to learn beekeeping. Of course, uh, <coughs> it's really a good, uh, a good place, a good training institute, yes. mm. RRTC, uh, that is a rural resource training center. Yes, and I would like to um, prefer this uh, this place for for training, as because I, uh, especially to the students. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Uh, even though we, we learn it theoretically, actually we, we also learn it theoretically, but yes. practically it differs, differs really really a lot in every in every in every aspects on how on how to handle yes. how to harvest and everything else. Mm -hmm. So I would like to say that you can come here mm -hmm. in this uh, place RRTC Umran uh, Repo District of Meghalaya. Okay. Thank you so much brother for sharing your experience and all the best once again. God bless you. Thank you very much friends for watching these videos. Please subscribe and share with your friends. Let's meet next video once again. Thank you. All the best. Bye bye.